is your starter for today. The Angry Birds go to the cinema. They arrive at 4 o'clock. The film lasts 1 hour. What time do they leave the cinema? Pause the video now to have a go. The Angry Birds film uh, lasts for an hour and it starts at 4. So they leave the cinema at 4. Have a go at the arithmetic task. the video now. Fifty five take away five is two fifty. Four times two is eight. You've got something plus something equals twenty, so you can do your number bonds to twenty. You could have ten plus ten equals twenty, you could do fifteen plus five equals twenty, you could do uh, seventeen plus 3 equals 20, lots of different ways to make 20. Half of 44 is 22. Here we have 21 and then 21 written in words. You have to use the less than, greater than or equal symbol. They are both the same, so you will be using the equal symbol. Choose an odd number between 8 and 14. You could have had 9, 11 or 2. One of these are correct. 48 plus 52 is 100. 12 times 3 is 36. Four, uh, 12 equals something times 4, it's 3 times 4. 61 take away 48 is 18. Two quarters of 50 is the same as half of a 50, so that's 25. Double 32 is 64. Today we're going to be looking at kilograms. A thousand grams is the same as one kilogram, which is written as kg. People weigh heavier objects in kilograms. in kilograms and not grams because it's too heavy. Find the mass of the Coca-Cola. So here you have the Coca-Cola and you've got some kilogram bricks. Read what it says and have a go at writing what the weight is of the Coca-Cola. Pause the video now. So you have 2 kg plus 1 kg is 3 kg and you can see the scale is even on both sides which means that the Coca-Cola weighs the same as this side which is 3 kg. So the Coca-Cola weighs 3 kg. Read the scales to find the mass of each. Because the scale is quite small there is a larger image here for you to do. And here is a weighing scale. Have a go now. The pumpkin weighs 4 kg. You can see that it's pointing at the 4. And the person weighs 50 kg. Emily's family are going on holiday. At the airport, they weigh their suitcases. Compare the weight of their cases using the less than, greater than, or equal than symbol. So, mum's case weighs 30 kg, Ellie's case weighs 20 kg, dad's case weighs 25 kg. Mum's case weighs something kg more than dad's case. So, you need to work out the difference here between mum's and dad's. And then Ellie's case and Mum's case, you're just comparing both cases and you're going to pop the symbol in here. Pause the video now to have a go. So 
smoke. Mum's place is 30 kg, Dad's place is 25 kg, so we're going to take the big number, take the smallest number away. 30 take away 25, which is 5. So Mum's place weighs 5 kg more than Dad's. Ellie's case is 20 kg and Mum's case is 30 kg. So you can see that Mum's case is much bigger. Ellie's case is less than Have a go at question one. It says, find the mass of the sweets and the beans. The sweets weigh something kg, the beans weigh something kg. So again, you need to add up this side, add up this side to find the weight. Pause the video now to have a go. We have 1 kg plus 1 kg equals 2. So we know that the sweets weigh 2 kg. The beans weigh, you've got 2 plus 1 plus 1, which gives you 4. So the beans weigh 4 kg. I wonder if you can work out how much 1 can of beans weighs. Question two, read the scales to find the mass of each. The bag weighs something kg. Again, because it is a little bit blurry, I've got a larger image here for you. And again, the person weighs something kg. You do have to be careful here because there are numbers that are missing out. So if you start with 40 and then find the difference between 40 and 45 here, that should help you to find the weight of the person. Pause the video now to have a go. So the bag weighs 4 kg. You can see that the red numbers are uh, going up in 1. So you've got 0, 1, 2, 3. And then you can't really see it, but it is 4. So the bag weighs 4 kg. And then the person, so you can see from 40, between 45 you've got 5. So you've got 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46. 47, so the person weighs 47 kg. Question 3. Sophie's family are going on holiday. At the airport, they weigh their suitcases. Compare the weight of their cases. Pause the video now to have a go. So Sophie's case is a less than dad's case. So pop the symbol in there. Mum's case weighs something kg more than dad's case. So you can see dad's is 21 and mum's is 25. So again, you're finding the difference. 25 take away 21, which gives you 4. So mum's case weighs 4 kg more than dad's case. Have a go at the reasoning and problem solving. So which unit would you measure the objects in? Grams or kilograms? So you have a child, a banana, a pencil, a laptop. The brown parcel weighs twice as much as the blue parcel. The green parcel weighs 2 kg more than 30 kg. The blue parcel weighs 12 kg less than the green parcel. Draw an arrow to show where each parcel would be on the scale. Pause the video now to have a go. So with the child, I would measure him in kilograms because obviously he's going to be too heavy to measure in grams. The banana, I would measure in grams because it's a light object. Same for the pencil, it's really light, so I would measure in grams. And then the laptop is quite heavy, so I would measure the laptop in kilograms. The green parcel weighs 32 kg. Don't worry if you didn't get to put the arrows on the lines because it is very it is very blurry and hard to see. The blue parcel weighs 20 kg and the brown parcel weighs 40 kg. 
ਹੈ ਸ੍ਰੀ